Well guys, welcome back to another update video tonight. I have a lot of stuff I'm going to be doing. I'm going to have some help to do this. I have to number all these drawers. I have, was it, uh, seven total stack-ons right now. I think I'm missing five. Hopefully they're coming tomorrow. I got to figure out what size uh, drawer they are so that I'll be able to figure out what I can put here because, you know, I have this extra section as well. You know what? I should test that out. I'll test it out here in a minute, see if it actually goes all the way over so that um, I will be secured and ready to go for tomorrow to number the rest. But I have Delta and Echo that I'm going to be doing tonight. My help is going to do these 120 drawers. However, I'm missing two numbers. So we're going to have to modify and uh, do like um, a little uh, Sharpie action for the last two numbers. And then we have all these that I'm going to try and do. Going to cut them all out, put them on the table like I did uh, previously on a live stream and uh just put the numbers on them it should work it should be uh awesome so that's what we have going on tonight and as soon as that's done tomorrow i will continue putting things into the drawers hopefully get it all done before next friday so i have exactly like seven days until then because uh i need it all done so i can actually transport it easily down to florida and all the extra stuff that i was supposed to get at the end of this week which my guy has not responded on I, uh, you know, sent him probably about $3,000 uh, for all this product. He's not getting back to me. I am a little concerned. He's very trustworthy. I, I've known that, but he, I guess, is overworked and, um, you know, has a lot of work with school, something like that. So you got all that going, but I'm, I'm actually doing pretty good with school. I got eight things left to do for four total classes, and I just started two classes this week. So I have a lot, but... I will probably be able to knock it out. I'm going to knock out one thing tonight, hopefully, before I get the help, which uh, I have about like 20-some minutes, so hopefully I'll get that done in time. But um, yeah, we got a lot to take care of. I got to respond to someone about some missing parts. He is way off with his numbers because he said there was 14 um, parts he ordered for a 1x3 black plate, and he actually only ordered five. So... I'm uh, double checking some things. Um, I did send him a part that was actually $2 worth and the other one was probably 50 some cents. So he got a freebie there, but I'm still going to refund him the parts that are actually missing uh, compared to what he's saying are missing. So um, that is uh, all for now. See you guys in a second or next clip. Well, guys, we had a lot of fun numbering all these drawers. So the Delta uh, bottom half is all done. Top half, um, I took the Tippity top one off so I can easily add the drawers into there and then just lift it up to the top so I don't have to use like the uh, the chair over there to stand on and such. But um, I have the top half of the numbers, 120 drawers, ready to go. I'm going to lay them all out and get started on the colors. going to figure out what I'm going to put here for on deck and the, uh, the drawer system will probably go here. I'll just transfer it over real quick. Echo is all numbered as well. I have 133 drawer that will be going uh, with Echo. It's going to be the very bottom, so I got to measure that out first, get that in place, and then I'll number all the drawers, and I'll get the rest put up here. I don't think I have enough screws. I only have one screw left, uh, or one set of screws left, so I need to get some more from downstairs. I did, I did get another stadium in, and uh, now I have two of them, so that is awesome. I'm going to be trying to part that out whenever I'm in Florida. The Adidas shoe is going to be ready to go tomorrow, supposedly, whenever I asked the community uh, on the Bricklink. Um, I was asking about the stadium and the shoe, and someone said the shoe will be ready tomorrow. The stadium, they're not working on it right now. Um, someone said that they might do it, but they don't know about it right now. But whenever I got this today, I saw the box was really badly damaged from the outside, so I was like, oh, this is done for. All the promotional sets in here, so got the sailboat pretty bad. You can uh, obviously see the damage right there. And this guy is really unfortunate. He's worth like $75. I sold one for $75. So I'm hoping that I get the other one here soon so I can add that to the store. And uh, they want this back. I don't know why, it's a little weird. So um, if they do, then I'll send it back to them. But hopefully they say, just forget about it and just keep it. So that'd be nice. And I could sell it for a little bit. So that'd be fantastic. But that's all for now. See you guys in a second for next up. Well guys, we're moving right along. Got a lot done already and dark blue gray, light blue gray and black are all that's left. That is fantastic. Got a few things to put away real quick for uh, blue. I'm gonna bring the drawers down over here so I can sit for a bit going through uh, hopefully all of this if it is possible while sitting, fingers crossed. 
And here is what the uh, stack on looks like right now. I am a little worried. Um, for some reason it is a little tilted, uh, but it is locked in and secured on the uh, thing. Shaking a bit, you can see it is all good for the most part. Uh, shaking the bottom, it's not screwed in down there, but um, I did find a few drawers over here that are empty, so I will probably fill those up real quick with whatever I find uh, right off the bat for the dark blue gray, but uh, I do have something that I need to double check for some reason. These guys I did not see on, um, on whenever I was going through the check, so, you know, I'll just search them up. Uh, I know I didn't sell them, so that's just a little strange. These guys are getting packed, so I need to organize them a little bit better and hopefully sell a lot of those here soon. I really need to try and be able to put the lids on those. Uh, those were all used, so you can see how many I've already gone through, but... Lots of stuff to go through for all the black. Uh, for the most part, everything's all sorted away. Uh, everything that is not yet sorted, um, I will hold off uh, till later. But to get all these cups out of the way, I will do uh, after I get done with light blue gray and dark blue gray. So, yeah. Well, it's taken a bit, but I've dwindled down the like hundred some cups I had over there. Uh, quite a bit. All we have left is things that need to be finished sorted. So I have things there and the rest of the things down there. So that shouldn't take me very long. Actually, I think the plates are already done. Um, so I can bring them up here and uh, add them to the uh, remarks here soon. Um, a lot of them are just going to be single drawers. So that's going to be super easy since I won't have to put in all the dividers and such. But yeah, we got uh, a lot done. And this section is almost filled up completely. We have... Probably another hundred and um, hundred and fourteen drawers left to go for that, and then I'll get Echo uh, put onto the wall. I will uh, number the rest uh, here soon. I actually saw that I have a bunch of numbers left for Echo, so that is perfect. And then I'll get the rest set up for uh, Foxtrot tomorrow. But that is all for tonight. See you guys tomorrow. Well, guys, it is Sunday, and we have. Five orders. We have three on Brick Owl. We have 18 lots, two lots, and three lots, worth a total of 23 lots and 175 items, $24 worth. So that is pretty nice. We'll go over to Brick Link real quick, and we have a total of 85 lots here. Uh, so about $100 ish um, getting out of this. So that's pretty nice. The last one's 135 or 1,335 items, so that's going to take a little bit, but I think most of it is all of these parts here, all the uh, black parts. So we have all the plates I, I haven't been able to put away yet, and they're going to be going out the door before I even put them on the shelf. So hopefully today we'll get the, those orders done quickly. I, I know the Brigal orders are pretty easy, so we'll knock them out. And then uh, we'll hopefully fill up the rest of this and hopefully not touch this yet because I need that for the ex expansion of the 50 plus sets I'm going to be getting. I think it's like 70 something sets now. I think 50 is the the one that I'm going to get in Florida. Like I asked him to ship to Florida so that I, whenever I get down there, I can start working on it because this other one has been taking way too long to get here. So I was worried that I wouldn't have it in time. So I'm hopefully playing the 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 smart game in a way on this to make sure that I have it down there for me to use uh, right away. So fingers crossed everything works out, but uh, right now I'm just going to work on these orders and uh, fill these drawers. All right, all five orders are done. Took me a while to count this one. This was the 63 lot one that uh, had parts everywhere. Uh, there was lots lots to count so got that one done uh, I think it will fit in this one so hopefully and we have three orders that will fit in this small minifigure one so that's fantastic very small order there even smaller here hopefully it'll fit in there some uh, big thick parts and this one should easily fit in here a bunch of black parts and the smallest order with vision and stickers which I have uh, this to hopefully protect it so Let's pack them up. So I got the orders all packed up. I began uh, going through things again, uh, trying to knock out all of the tiles 
seems like there is a lot. <laughs> I still have like 300 lots left or something to go through because all of it wasn't consolidated. I couldn't do anything about it. So that was unfortunate, but um, I should have definitely done light blue gray before I did black. So I wouldn't have this issue. Light blue gray shot up into oh, everywhere, um, all those little parts. So that sucks. I got to pull it out as soon as I'm done with everything else. I'm just going to knock out the this few section and then I had to get to work with a uh, school real quick. I have two things I need to get done and then um then I'll be free and then I can come back to all this and hopefully knock it out, get all these cups back so that I can get ready for the bonsai tree. If I can uh get that uploaded tonight, that would be fantastic. Um I would have more parts on the store again. But we are filling this puppy up real fast, so I'm a little worried whenever I get the uh other sets in and uh the big lot quantities hopefully i can consolidate it well but i don't know i'm uh filling up a fourth bin of that right now uh it's half full pretty much right now so that kind of sucks i have uh, a lot of large quantities in the store so hopefully i get bought out for some things quickly so uh that's right that's all for right now see you guys a second for the next up well, here is the last of the black parts completely sorted now, so that is awesome. Uh, actually, I still have the Technic parts over there, but not really worried about those right now other than having to pull the light blue gray out. But go going to knock this out real quick since uh, there's not much left. It should hopefully take me about 15 minutes probably. And uh got to pull, pull some more drawers out real quick, get that set up, and uh, we'll knock out the last color. And we should hopefully be good, but um, I am kind of worried for the future with uh, trying to add thousands of more parts. Um, it's a little crazy right now. Um, I think I probably added 20,000 parts to the store with uh, this mass upload before that filled up like two of these or something and almost four of uh, the 60 drawer over here. So we'll see how uh, an extra 50,000 parts probably does to uh, these remaining like six uh, stack ons. Well guys, I am completely done adding all the remarks to the parts in the store and they're in their rightful drawers now. So I am so happy, it's a big load off my shoulders that that's done. Now it's time to clean up, get things put away where they're supposed to go. Extra things are gonna go in the closet since I haven't been able to access it because of this AFO table. The AFO table is gonna come over here and be right next to um, a bookshelf here. This is gonna be used for picking orders. Uh, so I'm gonna bring it over there. This extra stuff is going in the closet. Stadiums, um, I'm going to be parting out here soon. Can't part them out onto the store yet, but I am planning on um, figuring out the quantities and get like 200 bags because I'm pretty sure it's only like 200 lots in the the whole set and I'll have like 11,000 parts out of it. So I definitely want to get that on the store ASAP because that'll be 11,000 extra parts. Uh, 100 pounds of Lego. I have an idea to bring it down to Florida with me so I can try and catalog it all um, by color and then by type to get it on the store while I'm down there, hopefully, fingers crossed. I am going to, before I leave, go through all this, figure out the set numbers and how much I paid for it all so that I know you know, the cost of goods for all this and then um, <clears throat> figure out the price that I can get for it. But right now, it's just about cleaning things up and getting ready for uh, the next steps before I leave, which also tomorrow I'm going to be working on um, uploading two and a half or two and a quarter pages of things that are already in my drawer system and wasting like 30 drawers and not being sold on the store. So I need that up right away. So I'm going to work on that tomorrow. I did get another order in, so that is ready to go for tomorrow. But that is all for right now. See you guys in a second for next up. And we have everything arranged so that I can uh, easily pick orders. Got the table right there. Uh, I'm going to figure out a good position for it, but, you know, I only have like a week and a half left, so uh, it's not going to last too long. I think whenever I'm at my mom's house, I'm pretty much going to be on the floor uh, with all the stack ons and such. So I'm hoping that I can fit it in the room that I'm going to be in. So fingers crossed. We'll find out here soon. But um, yeah, so much more open over here. Got the stadiums over here and the lights burnt out in here. So now I have three lights that do not work. One of them burnt out right here. So I had to replace it with one of the other ones here. So hopefully I can get new lights here soon. 
but we have nine orders now that are going to be going out today. I'm going to be leaving here in a minute. I've got to run a couple errands as well. And then once I come back, I shall part out the bonsai tree. I'm going to figure out how many cups I need real quick, get them uh, ready and uh, put them up here. going to, you know, quickly go through this because I don't think it's going to take very long, especially bag number three and number six. Those guys look pretty easy. This whole thing looks pretty easy. So it's going to be a quick and easy one. Um, hopefully, I think it's maybe 100 lots. So if it is, then, you know, I will hopefully take up maybe... 30 drawers or something uh fingers crossed if i can make that work that would be fantastic but that's all for right now all right guys i am ready to part out the bonsai tree i have it all loaded up um right now i'm separating out the black parts that are um needed to be put into drawers that i already have so i'm just going to come back to it as soon as i get all the other remarks set up i will uh you know go back to it but I don't think I have enough um, dividers right now, so I definitely will need to cut some more as soon as I get further into this. But right now I'm just gonna work on black and then brown, and then I have all the other colors over there. Uh, you can see the cups from the distance here, but uh, I'm just gonna put these ones in uh, these few drawers, get them put away, and then uh, keep on moving. Hopefully it doesn't take me very long. It didn't take me very long to sort through all these parts uh, individually. I think it was about uh, 35 minutes maybe uh, to organize it all. So uh, let's get on with the black real quick. Well guys, I did it. I began uh, sorting the Camp Now uh, Barcelona set, sets actually, two of them. And man, it is a behemoth. Uh, 32 uh, bags, I guess. And I didn't do the box ones uh, to start with. I did the other bags. So I knocked out quite a bit in an hour and 50 some minutes. I organized these other bags to get them ready. I will try and finish it tonight. It is currently 9.30. Definitely have a decent amount of time left. So I will try and uh, do it. I'm gonna work on the first two bags, one and two. Shouldn't take very long. There's a lot that should go by pretty fast for the most part. It's just, uh, you know, a little p repetitive, but luckily there's just one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, yeah, seven main colors. So that is pretty decent, uh, and we'll hopefully get this uploaded pretty fast on the store. I think it's about 214 lots, so 214 different types of parts. So for the most part, I am going to, you know, sort this all by color, then take it probably up here and sorted by uh, type up here on the uh, table instead of on the floor, potentially to uh, make it semi easier for myself, hopefully. And hopefully there's not a whole lot of many lots in each of these uh, little, you know, color banks and such. So fingers crossed it goes well. But uh, yeah, this looks beautiful over here. I really like it. It's going pretty awesome. Uh, Love in the store so far. Let's hope we get a bunch of orders and uh, continue to grow. Well, guys, I woke up to three orders on Brick Owl. We have six, six lots, three lots, 24 lots. Pretty nice value, too. This is, like, the total, and uh, the, the one above is how much I'm getting out of it. And then we'll go over to BrickLink real quick, and 25 lots, and this is about the same value for uh, all three of the Brick Owl orders. So that is pretty fantastic. I'm going to pick them real quick because I need to leave just before 10 for a Kia inspection. Um, it's a car that I'm gonna be using to go down to Florida. Uh, it's gotta be inspected uh, once a year or something like that. So here's the mess that I have over here that I'll deal with whenever I get back. So yeah, uh, that's all for now. See you guys, thanks for the next clip. And there we go. It took 24 minutes to knock out uh, these four orders. I'm not sure if that's too fast. I don't think it is. Um, I don't remember how many total lots it, uh, it is, but I could guess it's probably like three lots per minute, maybe. I don't know. So yeah, we have the four orders, the big one here, the medium sized one. This is kind of medium sized because of the, these big plate or panels and then the very small one. So that would be super easy. Uh, so I'm going to pack these up. Still haven't just before an hour to leave. So I will get these done and uh, bring them to the post office and 
probably walk home or something uh, from the place. I'm not sure how long an, an inspection takes, but it is my stepmom's birthday. She's about to leave, so I'm gonna go downstairs and say happy birthday. Well guys, it is currently the same day and I am very sorry that I did not get this out on Monday for you guys like I was intending to do, but I've been just super busy. The past couple weeks have been crazy trying to get the store arranged and such. Right now they have like 35,000 parts on the store because I uploaded the stadium after I got done with it. I was at the PA inspection and I did like 80 some lots while I was there and then I was like, okay, let me finish this when I get home. and finished it as quickly as I could and then I started sorting a little bit I need to sort a whole lot more tonight uh, I have like four hours until 10 p.m. still but I'm currently at the hospital uh, the ER specifically waiting for my dad he uh, um, it's my stepmom's birthday so she came home and she uh, took a nap and I guess my dad went on the bike real quick uh, the stationary bike and I guess he slipped and he cut his leg pretty much open uh, I'm not sure how big, but supposedly they couldn't patch it all up or something like that. I don't know how that works, but I'm just waiting for him uh, in the car. Uh, he's going to let me know when I can go pull around and pick him up or something like that. So, yeah, it's uh, it's been a crazy day, but I got everything on the store uh, for the stadium. So that's fantastic. Over 13,000 parts uploaded in uh a day span pretty much so that is awesome i'm so happy about that but now i have five orders three came before uh i uploaded the parts so i'm going to pick those first because they're already in the store and they're easy to find and such so i'm going to get, do that and then the rest of the night i'm going to try and uh sort through the rest of the parts for uh, the stadium set which it shouldn't take very long because there's just high quantities and this guy he ordered pretty much all of the major quantities so I was like, oh, that's fantastic. It's a $129 order. So that's like almost half of the money back for one stadium alone. So that's awesome. And I think it came out to $1,077, which was pretty crazy. Uh, that's after my um, sale. So that's that's pretty nice. But if I was able to part it out, like on Brickell, it was pointing to $2,000. So I don't know, that's a little weird, but $1,000 is pretty nice because that's like a $400 profit in a way. So I'm pretty happy with that, if not more of a profit, because I'm going to be getting like $65 in November for cash back and such. So I'm happy about that. But that is all for right now. Thank you all for watching. If you guys enjoyed, and I will see you on Monday um, for the rest of the clips for this week that I'm currently in. And then next week is going to be kind of crazy. Going to get ready to travel to Florida. So stay tuned.